So I'll do this with this again. So this is my uh, Laotian uh, wolf snake. And it's non-poisonous, but it is a biter. It bites as much as a uh, mangrove snake. <laughs> These things are crazy. I'm sure he's going to wake up here in a second. So if you didn't know, you might think it's a uh, banded crate or you might think it's a mangrove snake because they both, they all look kind of similar. Um, this area here looks like banded crate except that a banded crate has yellow and black um, alternating bands that are pretty close to the same thickness. This one I think is, oh yeah, he's, he bites quick. <clears throat> he's very small, so when he bites, he can be very fast. I'll play with him with this straw for a little bit. And uh, you never know when it's coming. He's very good at striking. Ah, yeah, the straw. You like that straw, don't you? I'll rub your stomach with that straw. What about that? So, um, he's got a little duty back here. And I think that's from the gecko. I had a little gecko I put in the tank, just hoping he would eat it, and I think he did, which is very good news. It looks like his, his belly's a little bit bigger than it was before. And that's cool. I'm pretty sure he ate that thing. I don't see it in the tank. Somehow, somehow those geckos get out sometimes, but I'm pretty sure he ate that one. And now I'm just getting him a little bit riled up. It's really fun to watch him strike. He never hits anything, but I'm sure he could. Yeah, these are great snakes. They're very small. This one's only about maybe 14 inches. But a beautiful snake. Um, basically harmless except it can get you on the finger or something. There, he's breathing fast. He's breathing heavy so he's ready to strike. Um, They're basically uh, nocturnal snakes and <clears throat> they eat stuff on the ground. They love frogs. Uh, and he's not really interested in biting all that much since he saw this straw. I think he likes this straw. It calms him. <laughs> Next time I pick him up though, I'm sure he's going to go a little crazy. Yeah, so he's ready now. I'll tease him a little bit. When he's really awake, he's, he's a firecracker, man. He doesn't stop biting, just like a mangrove snake. Like a mangrove snake will recoil, like strike, recoil, and then strike again, and then recoil, strike again, recoil. That's what this one does, but on a smaller scale. As I said, it's just over a foot long, and a mangrove snake is uh, a meter and a half sometimes. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> anyway, this is a very cool snake. And if he keeps eating the geckos, I'll be I'll be happy and keep them until I get my next snakes. Anyway, yeah, so I guess he's not very awake at the moment, which might be good. So I'll try to grab him and put him back in there. <clears throat> now he's starting to wake up a little bit. <laughs> he's striking sideways, but his head is staying pointed to the front, which is very weird. See, he just kind of strikes anywhere. Maybe just to show you he can strike, I don't know. <clears throat> anyway, I'll try to get him back in the, um, in the aquarium. Had some fish in here. And there's a dead one that ratted away. But apparently all the fish I think jumped out. Unless he ate them, which I'm hoping he ate them, but uh, I don't know if I maybe I had too much water in the bottom of that or not. I'm not sure. Oh there's the gecko, so he didn't eat the gecko. So I wonder what he did eat. That's funny. So the gecko is here, and if I can recapture him, of course I never have my net where I need it, if I can recapture him, I don't even know where he went, no. Damn, he's good. But he's not that good. Uh, so I got him in the uh, net here. So anyway, I'll wrap this up in, uh, Throw him back in the cage. Oh, so the snake hasn't eaten yet. Unless he ate some of those mealworms. I put a lot of mealworms in there for him, just in the off uh, chance that he that he would eat mealworms. And I don't know if he does. I, I kind of think he doesn't, but uh, I think he prefers small frogs and, and lizards and geckos and stuff. Anyway, I won't be able to do this with one hand, so I'm going to shut the camera off and... Uh, Get the uh, aquarium back together there.